And a huge sigh of relief today for parents of thousands of New York City public school students. Yeah, schools Chancellor David Banks announced that school bus drivers will not strike starting Monday. A strike could still happen in the coming weeks, but both sides are now vowing to continue to negotiate in good faith. Eyewitness News reporter Anthony Carlo has the details from PS 125 in Harlem. Well, that's right. Parents have been holding their breath, envisioning a possible scramble to figure out how to get their kids to school should there be a strike. Well, now some temporary relief, but the question is for how long? The school's chancellor says there will be no bus driver strike Monday and that both sides will likely stay at the negotiating table for weeks to come. But the bus driver union pushing back, saying time is running out. The chancellor made his remarks after visiting with kindergartners at PS 125 in Harlem this morning. Ironically, the book he read to them featuring a picture of a big yellow school bus. We want those bus drivers to keep driving, he told the kids. The chancellor marveling at the results of his administration's focus on improving reading. The percentage of PS 125 students reading at grade level grew from a dismal 30% all the way up to 70 just last school year. But of course, children must get to school to continue to improve. And that's the concern this school year. A bus driver strike would impact more than 80,000 kids who depend on buses. Chancellor Banks did not indicate what specific progress has been made, but only that any possible strike is days, if not weeks, away. Parents should not be concerned about a strike in the near future, which is a great thing. It gives us even more time. Doesn't mean that it won't happen, but uh, we certainly don't see anything happening in the next several weeks. All of these parties care about what's happening with our kids and our families. They really do. A spokesperson from ATU Local 1181, the bus driver union, not as optimistic, saying there remains a potential strike. There is no commitment not to strike. While we are doing everything we can to avoid a strike and negotiations are ongoing, time is running out. Now, the city does have a contingency plan in place should a strike happen at some point. Coming up at 6 o'clock tonight, I'll have more on why the school's chancellor is fired up about what he says is misinformation regarding the influx of migrant students in schools.